welcome to OX Budget. Make sure you comment, like and subscribe to the channel. Hello and welcome back to OX Budget. So for me, this is week three of November and it's been tough. I'm not going to lie, it's been really tough. Firstly, let's thank all the new subscribers. So thank you so much for subscribing, liking and the lovely, wonderful comments. Secondly, thank you so much for supporting me over on my Etsy shop. It's been amazing. The past two weeks have been absolutely incredible for me over on my Etsy. So thank you so much. As I mentioned in last week's video, it's really difficult this time of year to budget and to cash stuff because of Christmas. So Christmas takes a lot of, a lot of my money, basically. So I've got my money out my bank for this week and we've got... Let's do 20s first. We've got 2, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 10, 20, 30, 45. So we've got £145 to stop. Now I've left £20 of this money in my business account as a buffer. I would like that buffer to be 50 but obviously with Christmas I'm a bit willy-nilly at the minute. I've obviously got my cup of tea as always, my biscuits that seem to disappear all the time, I don't know why, my new fresh nails that I had done a week ago, four days ago, love my nails, and then my cash stuffing binder, and my new notebook that will be available in the shop shortly. I've got here an A6 and an A5, um, it was funded through Kickstarter, I try and attempt to do a Kickstarter once a year. Um, and there is a notebook coming out, which is a foiled notebook, which hopefully will get to me at the end of January. I want to dip before Christmas, but it is what it is. I've got a key ring that says, Mikey, my dreams are reality coming out as well. So these will be available. I'm going to put them up at the end of November, beginning of December for people to buy. You can buy them as a set or you can buy them separately because they're really nice for this to just jot whatever. And then obviously the cash stuffing, I mentioned in my previous video, the cash stuffing um, notepads that are available now. So if you're interested, then uh, look down below. So it's going to be a bit wishy-washy again because I'm not going to lie, I'm a bit all over the place. And I feel, so I've mentioned this before, I get paid on a, on a the, around the 14th of the month. I'm struggling really bad with the fact that it's slap bang in the middle of the month and it's not at the end of the month. So I'm struggling with making sure I've got enough funds in my bank to cover, which is something that I need to learn to do. And I know with time, it will come a subconscious thing that I do rather than a conscious thing that I keep thinking about all the time. So I'm having to move money here and there all of the time just to make sure I've got enough funds, which seems really stupid, but it is what it is. And for example, the other day, I had to borrow money off my partner to transfer to my bank because I'd forgot about something that, that was coming out that I hadn't actually accounted for. So this month has been an eye-opener of all the transactions that I pay for on my bank account that, I, that I'd forgotten about, like little things like Amazon Prime. I hadn't put that into my um, calculations of month, monthly outgoings. Um, I also pay for Microsoft every month. I didn't count for that. So it's little things like that that I'm learning. And obviously, come January, February, March, it'll be more months that I'm more organised and better. And obviously, Christmas isn't here and stuff. So I'm going to stop moaning. Let's get on with this. So we've got 145. I've got... Let's have a look. Um, Gifts has got 40. I think. Yeah, 20, 20. 10, 20, 30, 40. Now, I still need to do a little bit. I've ordered some presents. So I've done my partner. I've done my sons. I need to do my little girl. Uh, yeah, it's... We're going to come back to this because I feel like a lot of it's going to go in here, which is really frustrating. But stock, I'm not going to fill up because I actually spent £45 yesterday when I got my money on stock for the business and I feel like that's all I ever do. I feel like I just buy stuff all the time for, and it's things that I need. So I don't know if you've no, noticed on my Instagram, I've been doing the wax melts for 
Christmas gifts for a wholesale order and peeps, someone messaged me and wanted to buy one. I thought, okay, which is great because it's more business, but I've had to buy more wax. So that's like £25 plus delivery. Um, And then I've had to buy more packaging. It's just, I just feel like I'm buying stock all the time, which is amazing. But when you earn this money and then you've got to put it back into cardboard boxes, it it is quite frustrating so I'm not going to put any money in that and I do feel like taking the £20 out but then it's nice taking the £20 out and putting it in my putting it in something else right we're going to put £20 in out because I'm going out soon and I've got no money so I'm, I'm actually going to do that so the date which we always do I think it's the 24th I cannot be too sure. I'm going to write 24th because I don't actually know. And we're going to put £20 in. And the reason I'm doing that is I'm going out. Um, I told you last week, didn't I? I've got a meal to go to. And I've already paid a deposit, but you've got to pay the rest, which I think is £30. Then I'm also going out, out. And I still need an outfit. So, yeah, it's not going very well. But anyway, misc, nothing it is what it is. Savings, 30. Probably not going to put anything in at the minute. Probably not going to put anything in emergency or holidays. All in all on these, I've got 30 savings, 10 emergency, holidays, 20. So this, I still need to do a vinyl thing, which I'm going to do in a minute. My um, baby's asleep. So we're definitely going to do that. And I'm going to write my name on it. This is Christmas money from family members. And there should be £220. Two, six, eight, ten, twenty. £220 for me to do whatever I want with it. I don't know what I'm going to spend it on. It'd be quite a nice treat. Petrol. So my partner filled up our tank. But I'm going to put a ten in. Because um, I need to obviously keep filling it up. Avon. So two, four, six, eight. I'm gonna put a tan in Avon. I know, I think it Avon rolls around every three weeks, I think. I don't know, I'll have to double check that because I don't actually know. That can wait till next year, that can wait till next year. We've just me and my partner just bought them a coat. Um health, I've got 20. So this is eye test, which I'm actually gonna book one soon. Um, yeah, stuff like that. Beauties, nothing. Christmas for next year is nothing. And then we've got Tyler's money at the back, as always, which I have got my new wallets now, so I'm going to finally make him a little folder. So, as annoying as it is, the rest of this is going to go into Christmas. So we've got two, four, six, eight, ten, and five. So 105 into Christmas. And obviously, as we move out of Christmas, we can put money everywhere you know it won't be so rigid right so let's count this again I'm going to do 20s first and then 10s and 5s so 2, 4, 6, 8 9, 10, 1 so 1, 10, 20, 30 45 145 pounds I think it's the 24th I don't actually know 105 add and then it's a hundred and forty five pounds um that's a lot of money so and we haven't got that much to buy for um and i'm trying to actually go to the shops like i need to go to argos there's a few things i want from there for my daughter um i need to put this in don't i i'm looking at it thinking that doesn't look right um what else i've got to buy little things i need to buy some stuff online so i'll have a little look and write it down and then put it back in my bank but it literally stops me from spending the money that i don't need to spend that's the whole point of this system i've got a few of these that i want to make new of so i'm thinking about getting another binder and mixing it up and getting a bit more organized but i am going to stop rambling there because i always do this and i start rambling luckily only one biscuit left us today as always, I thank you so much for watching. Uh, likes and comments are so appreciative. I make sure that I comment back to you and uh, build a relationship community. 
So if you'd like to talk to me, I'm over on Instagram. My inbox is always open to talk to anybody about anything. And yeah, have a fantastic, fabulous rest of the week. And I'll see you next week. Bye.